Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. Back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. So I've been realizing that in my last couple of videos I've been like getting significantly more sad like sounding in my videos and I feel like that's not that was weird because I was watching the back and I'm like why do I sound so sad so I'm not actually sad nothing's wrong I think maybe I was just trying to be quiet because there was actually people in my house and I'm house sitting so there's no one in this house right now so I can be as loud as I want except that that window's open so my neighbors can probably hear me because I can normally hear them when they talk so you know I just realized that so there's a dead spider on the floor charming this is my 31 week pregnancy update and that's crazy to me to say because I remember back when I was like in the teen weeks I thought I was never gonna get to 30 weeks like not because I didn't think I was like ever gonna get there really because like obviously I was time doesn't time keeps going I just really couldn't fathom it honestly I couldn't see myself being in like the last trimester the home stretch and that's where I am I'm in the home stretch and that's really crazy to me because it's gone by so fast and I kind of have some like oh shit kind of moments where I'm just like oh god you know there's six to nine weeks left and every time I tell someone that like I tell someone excitedly and I'm like oh there's six to nine weeks left and they're just like I know like that with that facial expression I'm just like what is that so I'm excited but I'm also kind of freaking out and I think I've entered the whole freaking out stage I haven't entered the nesting stage yet which I want to but I I can't ever see myself nesting because I'm such a lazy person but it's apparently it's gonna happen sometimes so I'm just waiting for that so I can get like all this cleaned up because honestly actually looking at it now I kind I kind of don't like I don't like this at all and I kind of want to fix it but I don't think that's nesting I think that's just cuz I'm freaking out because there's going to be this tiny little human. And by the way, I picked up a three and a half pound bag of candy and I was holding it. And that makes me really excited because Halloween's right around the corner and I love Halloween. I love fall and I love Halloween. But I was picking up this three and a half bag pound of candy. And in all of my pregnancy apps tell me that right now he's supposed to be three and a half pounds or close to that and I was picking up this bag of candy and I always thought three and a half pounds because he's like so little for a newborn so he's supposed to like double that so I just always assumed that he was really really tiny in there but I picked up this bag of candy and I'm like why is this so heavy I feel like this is heavier than it's supposed to be but it said three and a half pounds right on the bag so I was like that's really crazy and it makes me feel less fat because of the fact that I know that like that much weight is not me and it's actually him so that makes me feel better about myself a little bit um, 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 um symptoms yes so this I've been getting extremely cranky and I, I think that maybe because I start school and I don't like being around people I'm not very social especially people that are younger than me and people that make stupid decisions they make me angry and so I basically I'm ready to cut people like every single day and I don't know if that's me being ultra pregnant or if it's just me being me because I was kind of like that before and I think now it's just heightened um, um, um so yeah everything hurts basically like my back is constantly in pain but I think I've kind of just gotten used to it to the point where it's like pain's just a part of my life now um the peeing is so constant and so just annoying because I'll get comfortable and it's like oh no time to pee and his movements are so painful now and I don't know if it's because he's kicking organs and kicking my ribs and kicking my body but like my stomach is just sore like all the time and when he kicks because he's always moving and jabbing his like elbows and little limbs into me in the same exact spot because he hasn't moved like his position has remained exactly the same because his movements are all in the same 
places. They're either down really low in my pelvis, on my right side, or way high up under my right boob. And the ones on my right side, when he kicks, I kind of have to go like, no, 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 kind of like someone like, don't touch me because it's really, really sore and it hurts. And the ones that are up high, it's kind of like so uncomfortable because I can't slouch anymore and I'm a super huge sloucher. So I have to stand up tall. And he's so high up now that like I had to read in class and I was reading and I had to like pause and just like I was reading I was just like give me a break I only read like literally four sentences and I could not continue I was just like someone needs to do this for me because I can't I can't do it and I'll climb up the stairs and then want to rant to my mom about something and I sat on her bed and I was about to start this rant it was going to be really really good but I couldn't breathe and I'm always hot and I'm always sweating and it's super uncomfortable and I'm just constantly upset because I'm so uh, so uncomfortable and like do you see how red my face is right now it's because I'm talking a lot and it's making me like not have oxygen oh so I'm burping I've recently gotten a lot of bad heartburn um I've been ravenously hungry about 24 7 and people like to point that out like why is that like a favorite thing of people like when you're pregnant to point out how much you're eating I'm just like I get it okay this is hard work and I don't want to be mean to people but I already feel huge and so when when people are like oh someone's eating for two I just want to punch them in the face because I feel like an elephant walking around, moving around. I've gained like 30 pounds and I'm not happy about it, but there's not a lot I can do at this point except try and keep it there and not gain as much weight, but he still has to gain at least another three pounds. So, anyway, I had to get another shot at the doctor's office and they did start measuring me. So I'm measuring perfectly fine, even though I look like I'm, 11 months pregnant I'm they said I'm measuring good so yeah I'm gonna stop talking because there was actually a lot to say in this vlog and normally I don't have a lot to say so I'm gonna do the belly shot now yeah okay so move that okay so by the way this is my dad's shirt so I know I don't look cute right now <laughs> Here it is from the side, from the other side, yeah, yes, beautiful, love those. So far none on my belly though, I'm hoping it stays that way. Um, this is a, something that I like picked at myself, don't just ignore everything. And I think I look really pregnant from the front, like really round so that's cute and the other side okay so <laughs> thanks you guys so much for watching this update I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it's somewhat easy to follow it's a little bit longer than my normal ones but thanks you guys so much for watching and I will check back in in my next video bye guys <laughs>